Hello my legion of little goblins, this is Gamer Dragon, and welcome back to Let's Play Spiral the Dragon Reignited. So today... This is the day we go face Metalhead. Well, first, first up. no, first we gotta go to the uh, the the treasure like bullshit. Ah, wild flight. My in the original game, this was actually my least favorite because. Well, you'll see why. Probably. You have to get a little... Cause this was like a bit of a tricky maneuver. See? Because the uh, the river, that stream has a has a bit of a has a in, has a bit of an incline. Or is it an incline? Yeah, it's an incline, and then a, then that run has a decline. And then I have to hit like arches, and then boats. And then, of course, missing shit, which can result in a big fucking fuck up. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, thank you. Seriously, that 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 one stress too much of it. Now it's Metalhead. Press that flight, the flying round um, only took four minutes. If this had been the original version, it would have taken me like ten. 
because of that incline and then that decline... Someone decided to put metal armor on the, uh... On the little monkeys. I'm so glad I don't have to go through that through there again. The one that throws the bananas barely has some survival instinct. Like me, who wants to go out and get some fucking pretzels? Soft pretzels. <laughs> you know, then walking through the cold and the snow. I got boots. Metalhead is all charged up to meet you. Attacking the power pole should disrupt his power supply. Cool. I used to think Metalhead was kind of cool. Mm. Mm. He definitely looks a lot more intimidating. Oh yeah, um, once you get in with Metalhead, you can't go back until you beat him. So no saving your fucking progress! Fuck! Whoa. Now you can use Hit Metalhead's little... Little beastie friends. To, to actually destroy the others are all green. You could get Metalhead to to destroy these. Destroy his own power poles, but I think we'll get him to do that. Let me see if I can get him to do that. There we go! 
was that skill point for? Oh, I forgot to get the... Oh! So, uh, you guys want to go back and, uh, get some skill points? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm not interested in the skill points. Man, there were a lot of monkeys ready to die for this asshole. miss a couple gems over there. I'll get those in a moment. First, I need to get under this platform. Alright, got those. Let's grab these. And play a game mode where there's the last fucking gem. in a rough. better now that so many dragons have been rescued. Yes. Jump in the balloon and I'll show you the Dreamweaver's world. Are you ready to go? Yeah, let's go. So, I have a theory about Dreamweavers. That it's not actually a world in and of itself like the others. But like it's a floating... It's a bunch of floating islands. That, you know, travel between the worlds, granting dreams to everyone. And, you know, looking around at this, this really does appear to be the case. Oh, I just love this. And I love that pink and purple sky with with the auroras. Okay, I like Dreamweavers actually is my fit was actually my favorite worlds. What because of one the aesthetic appeal.
the fairy tale themes. No, that dickhead isn't gonna change those, uh, change the size of those bitches. So we gotta get to that can cannon to change the size of them bitches. Fool's errand. And that's the world boss. We're not gonna go fight him today. We'll probably be fighting him on Saturday. Rumors probably also controls the, some of the weather in in the Dragon Worlds too. Oh, I got it. Out. I had the wrong fucking idiot. Oh, I see flight. Another really pretty one. secret room somewhere here. Oh, right. Sorry. Welcome to the Dreamweavers, young one. While chasing Nasty's minions in this world, you must expect the unexpected and prepare for what is not there. Most of the Dreamweaver dragons have feathered wings. Dragons with feathered wings and aesthetic I love. I found the secret room the first time. I mean, it's not an essential. It's not essential to find the secret room, but. Done. How 
I'll be done when I've toasted that nasty Nork. I can just imagine so I just imagine something funny like you said in that bitch flying off the cliff and she just goes splat in front of a pair of dragons who are just chop talking. done. The fools you see in this world are invincible, but that does not mean they shouldn't be attacked. Sounds all right to me. Why is everybody so mean to jesters and fools? Oh, I would love a Spyro the Dragon Tarot deck. Like, can you imagine? How beautiful the artwork would be, especially for Dreamweavers. Oh my god, look how pretty this world is. Dark Passage just got like such a fucking upgrade. I can't tell if these pink speckles in the tiles are, um... If the pink speckles in the floor are like flower petals or they're act or fall or gems that fell from I just can't tell. Why did they make them look more like, you know? I'm I'm sorry, why did they make the little the little dogs look more dog like? Because they look like little Frenchies, and I and I don't really like the idea of attacking little Frenchies. The enemies here can be quite frightening, but you should watch the fools. I'd rather flame the fools. Now you're thinking. He is high on whatever incense he is burning. Look at this! Look at this! It's so swirly. And I guess it does sell the idea that these gemstones are are actually embedded in the floor. What the- Fuck you, asshole. Bad dog- Fuck! Those hellhounds are scary as fuck, though. Thank you for releasing me. Put the constellations on his wings.
What are those? Corrupt cupids or something? You know, I think you just might be the dragon to defeat Nasty Nork. That's me, all right. Oh yes, no point in coming up here. And let's find a few little, sh some little shroomies to heal ourselves. Ooh, sorry, little shroom dude. Android. Oh right, I forget how I sometimes forget how big Dark Passage actually is. to help you catch nasty but i'd really hate to be trapped in crystal again don't worry the only one that's going to be trapped is him oh his wings are so pretty Yelp like dogs. That's like, no. Thank you for releasing me. I get so sick of here, Erin. Thank you for releasing me. All right, and with that set, done, being done, thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video and want to see more, like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell notification icon, and share this video with someone who might enjoy the series. I'm Gamer Dragon, and I'll see you next time. Holy fuck, that's gorgeous!